guys welcome back to another episode of i love fishing and today we are out here at this uh, cool lake here in orlando uh this resort is like a mile away from the disney world and all that good stuff here and we're gonna try out this lake to see if there's any fish it's a private lake no public access um uh, there's reports of 12 pounders and stuff in here so i'm assuming you know there's big fish here but they are pretty hard to catch <laughs> learning about florida fishing so see how we do and uh see you guys in a bit okay Got this cool curly ribbon tail worm here. Give it a try and see what takes this guy. So there's that uh, guided bass boat over there. It's the only bass boat on this lake. It's part of that uh, company's water sport rental stuff, but you could pay to go get a guided bass fishing trip on this lake. So, seem to be at the same distance as we usually are for fishing on a watercraft. question comes to what is it that they're using right now for this time of year I don't even think something right here. Hop. 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 Alright guys, as you guys can probably tell, I am ending my trip now. There's no fish, no nothing for me. I was not able to get on anything at all. Um, so far my experiences so far fishing in Florida has been pretty bad. Uh, besides that guided trip, I was using live bait and then that night the skyway pier fishing that was cool but so far all these uh inland you know casting around and stuff nothing uh, i guess a lot of people do say uh, minnesota or midwest area do have very good uh, quantity of catching fish so you know i'm starting to see it uh, these lower 
areas throughout the nation are probably more of quality and not quantities. Hope you guys enjoy this and then uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.